Hello everyone! Welcome to the first video of 2022 and also the first video that I filmed since I took a few months off from filming anything. So, today or this week or this month, I don't really know what I'm doing yet. I just know that I'm starting a new crochet blanket and I have plans to film it. I have the stuff set up here in the kitchen. These are the yarns that are going to be used in the blanket. So I will montage me working on the blanket and then I'll talk at you the next time. or maybe two weeks at this point and this is how far I am on the blanket. I didn't really crochet much last week because it was Christmas so I was doing Christmas cookies but now here we are. I zoomed in the picture and this is backwards so this is the front side. the last time I gave a little update on where we are with the picture blanket. This is the blanket, oh gosh, so far. Let me unroll it a bit. So, this is the first person and her arm and then like her body. And then her doggy, that is his legs and tail, and then his front leg and then his chin. And then this is the other doggy and the other person and the, his legs. It's about, I think, halfway. I think I'm on line 86 or 87. Let's look. I am on line 
88. So today I will work on this a little bit more, but we're adding a whole new level of distraction to this because I'm getting a puppy and then I got this book for Christmas. It's about there's like how to teach your dog how to talk with those buttons. Seen it on Instagram. I think we're actually going to try this. I'm kind of excited. I also got buttons for Christmas because, you know, puppy stuff. So I'm going to be reading slash listening to that as I crochet. this blanket to show the progress so so far I've completed both doggies and one human and then here is the second human behind this doggie and right there on my computer is the pattern of his face. These parts of the blanket it should get faster and faster because more and more of the blanket is the background colors and since I don't have to switch the colors very often I can crochet those parts quite quickly unlike when I was doing like the jacket sleeves and over here where there's a lot of color changing. So I'm gonna work on this today. I am about 75% done with this blanket. I'm hoping to finish this like this weekend but I don't know if that's actually gonna happen because today is Friday and that's a lot of crocheting to do, but we'll see.
I just finished I was I've been determined on Friday night I was like there's only whatever many rows left like I could probably get it done I did it I don't think you're ready for this masterpiece. <laughs> ah, there it is. I'm gonna stand up on the chair. I know, it's dangerous, but risky measures will be taken so you can see the full picture. In this picture, it is Will and Esther and Ego and Louie. I think the dog's faces turned out the best. Esther's looks good, close up and from far away. Will's looks really good from far away. But then when we get closer, it's a little bit like... <laughs> Echo's tongue is one of my favorite parts. It's so cute. And then over there, I already started back up at zebra making. I was going to film this blanket making process with like daily updates but then I got distracted and started using working on the blanket as a tool to help me during the holidays so it didn't end up getting filmed. Basically long story short I was crocheting away in my zoned out bliss from all the world that's happening but anyways here it is and that was a really long explanation that I'm probably gonna not even put in the video so why am I still talking? I don't know. Well, I hope you guys join me to crochet on the next one, and I'll see you later. Bye!